Well, here it is Saturday morning, and I haven't really figured out uh, a project to work on this weekend. I don't know what I'm going to do. I'll come up with something, I think. And I'm kind of getting a late start here because I had some yard work I wanted to take care of this morning and all that. Uh, it's just endless yard work, especially in the summertime. And I got an oil filter for the car because I forgot to get one the other day. So I was going to change the oil until I discovered that my wife and my son were going to go see Harry Potter <laughs> this morning along with well everybody else. So I kind of got out of changing the oil in the car. <laughs> but I did kind of crawl under there and figure out where the oil filter is and everything. And uh, it looks like it's going to be a real pain to get under there. I'm going to have to jack up the car. You might remember a while back when Rick Beal dropped off a bunch of wood in front of my shop in the middle of the night. <laughs> it was like a Christmas present in the morning. But anyways, he left the curly redwood and I briefly showed you this piece here, which is all rough and it's, uh, it's cut on two sides, you know, fairly flat. It's like triangular shaped on it. But anyways, I was thinking about what do I want to do with this thing and one of the things I was thinking about doing is getting an angle grinder. Have you guys ever worked with an angle grinder for doing carving? You know, like make a, a little totem pole <laughs> kind of thing out of this? I don't know. I've never done that before. If anybody has done that sort of thing and has any tips, uh, you know, I'd kind of like to keep the bark on there if I could. But I'm not sure about making a design and how I would follow that design. I'm, I'm not really that artistic you know, freehanding stuff. So if you have any tips, or if you have any tips of what else I could do with this wood, that would be great. I'd love to, you know, keep it looking rough somehow. I'd like to keep all that bark on there. I think once I clean that up, it's gonna look really cool. So I don't really wanna just saw it into boards. 